Authorities say a man entered Vandergraaf's Cortez coins around 5 Wednesday afternoon, pretending to need his jewelry appraised. The suspect unexpectedly pulled out a gun and pistol whipped owner Fred Vandergraaf, then pulling the trigger at least three times, but the gun misfired and never went off. The suspect fled on foot after Vandergraaf grabbed his own pistol from behind the counter, firing one shot back. Dave Bristow of the Manatee County Sheriff's Office says they are unsure if the suspect was shot, but added things could have been much worse. It's very difficult, uh, you know, for store owners because, you know, they're trying to conduct a business. So obviously, um, you know, they want to do business with people and they come in and they act like they're doing business and all of a sudden this happens. Vandergraaf was treated on scene for a laceration on his head. Although he did not mind being on camera, he was not ready to speak to the media just yet. Vandergraaf told me he is waiting until after the suspect is caught before he shares his story. But for Donna Groover, who was inside her next door salon at the time of the incident, it was all too close. He just walked across the parking lot and he came in and then he left and he came back and then I heard the gunshot. And he ran across the parking lot and ran down 301, like going towards your parish. And I went over and saw Fred. And was Fred okay? No, Fred was bleeding from his head. So I thought he was shot, so I called 911, and then chaos broke loose.